Hey everyone, this is my Rite Aid couponing trip that I did on February 1st. I was wanting to take advantage in doing the spend time, get back $3 and up reward for the Lipton Tea product. This week, or last week, they were on sale for 2 for 6, the 100 count Lipton Tea bags. The only thing with Rite Aid is that they have a low limited stocking and um, I wasn't wanting to mix it with any other items, so so at most they might have four and below. And for the ten dollars that you spent, you have to do it in one transaction in one store. So if you purchase two of them, and Basically, you will not get the up reward and that you have to do a return at another store and get your other two. So I just didn't want to deal with that. And I found out that my grocery store has an even better deal there. Buy one, get one free. And for every 15 you spend, you save $5 off at instantly at the register with your VIC card. So I just decided to do the food deal at the last minute. The deal is spend 15, get back a $5 in up reward. So I purchased two of the Lay's chips. I buy one, get one free. Four planters peanut product for $3 each. I picked up two dry roasted peanuts and two honey roasted peanuts. And yeah, my subtotal for all of this was $16.29. I did use a $4 and up reward, a $1 alpha 2 low to car coupon for the planter's peanuts, and a free manufacturer coupon for the planter's peanuts. So that brought it down to $7.29. And I was was wanting to use another one dollar alpha two coupon but I kind of forgot that I always save those low two car coupons. They're really helpful and um they save you a lot of money every time um from clipping coupons and stuff like that. So so I did got back my five dollar and up reward for doing the um for spending fifteen dollars or more on the food products. And, yeah, the Planters Peanuts, I got one of them for free, and two of them for two fifty, and the third, and the fourth one was $3, so I didn't think that was a bad deal on that. So it was like paying $3.29 after I got my $5 and up reward, and... The Aleve is $7.49. I had a $3 manufacturer coupon as well as a $3 in-store coupon. And these are the 50 count caplets. They are the pain reliever and um, I know that if you have gold or silver discount it makes it free or 74 cents. And in my case since I didn't have a gold or silver or discount, I had to pay a dollar forty nine. I wasn't happy with it, but I mean I didn't have a choice to pay that much. But it was better than not having to pay the regular retail price for it. So anyways, this is what it looks like on the receipt here. My subtotal was nine seventy eight. After tax, made it ten sixty five. I wasn't wanting to spend that much at Rite Aid on Saturday. I was hoping that it would have been less, and um, I was wanting to do the pistachios still, but I didn't have my video value coupon, so um, it was better to get two lays. Then having to purchase one of those pistachios because that they are BOGO. So so I thought that was an even better deal in my opinion. 
So anyways, um, all of this counts towards the winner saving games, buy and earn. So um, I spent $23.78. Hopefully I can get my um, $15 up reward whenever I reach $100. So um, in the spend 15 get back $5 up reward is still tracking. So the limit is two, but um, since I spent less out of pocket, um, or since since I didn't go, since I went over by a dollar and twenty cents, I still could do the deal, but I decided not to do it. So and I um already got my up reward. So so yeah, um I did um. However, I what told the manager that she had four of the planters peanuts that was the dry roasted and the honey roasted in the plastic canister but she only had two two of each that was that was in a 16 ounce and that was in a 12 ounce instead of what I mentioned earlier and and yeah, whenever I came into the Rite Aid store, she realized that was me and that, um, were you holding for your planter's peanuts? She asked me that. I was like, yeah, and, um, she, she wanted to ring me up so badly and I didn't mind because she was a store manager. She is really nice, you guys, and I, and I normally don't shop at this Rite Aid, so, um, I'm coming there more often because they have a lot of, although that they are in a shopping center, there are more customers coming into that Rite Aid store than the one near my house. So I'm not so sure why, but I guess it's just the area and where we live in. And, um, but anyway, she, her store has, has the, the clearance Kleenex, everything, like, she will have, I mean, like, her store will have a lot of stuff than the other Rite Aid store. But anyways, we just had a whole conversation about the Rite Aid and the cashier and all this other stuff. And, um, you know, she didn't give me any issues with my coupons. And I really want to thank her for um, not giving me an issue with that. And I think... She also mentioned that she wanted a coupon as well and that it just takes time to coupon and stuff like that. So, and, you know, that sort of thing. So, yeah.